morning everyone um, this morning I got this package and I was waiting for it um, and it's sent to me by Indigo Blue um, it's exactly two weeks ago that I placed an order at Indigo Blue in the UK uh, a few of my favorite artists um, work a lot with products from Indigo Blue and I was so curious about their paints uh, mainly and I searched um, here in Holland if I could buy those paints uh, here because I thought the shipping cost would be very expensive and um, I couldn't find any. Uh, we sell uh, some of Indigo Blue products here uh, uh, in Holland. Uh, I mean there are a few products of Indigo Blue available here in Holland. Mainly the stencils really and the, uh, few, and the stamps. Um, but uh, none of the paints. I couldn't find the paints anywhere. So I was quite disappointed until Mike Deacon told me uh, why don't you go and see because I think they are quite reasonable with their shipping costs and indeed they are so shipping costs to Holland cost me about seven British pounds and as you consider that a British pound is less than one euro, in fact the shipping costs are even uh, cheaper than I uh, would have to send a package here in Holland. So I uh, placed an order just to try some things like the paint. I mean I have a few of the stencils um, I have in my stash but none of the paints so he really was waiting for this. Let me see here they are and also I really like the containers the little um, bottles the pots that th these paints are in um, because I think that is easier to work with than something like uh, this, a, a tube. There's always uh, paint left in here uh, that you can't get out or you have to cut it. So, wow, this is the English cottage burning bonfire. Look at the color. <gasps> Ooh. That looks delicious. The post box red, also the English cottage. And the uh, hot cocoa matte. These are all matte. And also from their range uh, Junk and Disorderly I have the Stroke of Midnight which is a very very dark blue purple-ish. Wow! luscious colors so also have the junk and disorderly steam whistle these are all matte paints and the warm tan just ordered a couple of them so I could try and these um, do I have anything here with the pricing on no but I believe these were about uh, six uh, British pounds 
$5.99 or something like that. I'm, I'm not sure. Also, while I was at it, I wanted to try the G So Good Gesso, the white gesso. It's a little pot of 120 milliliters. So, oh, here the price. Oh, is the pricing on it? No. No, no. This was 4.75. Gee, so good. A oh, white gesso. I found a store here in Holland that sells these, the black and the white. But I thought, well, while I was at it. So, and also, this is my first real art journal. I always work in, uh, well, in, in old books or um, uh, just on watercolored paper or uh, everything I can uh, lay my hands on, really. Never bought a real art journal. So, put this aside. And see what we have here, of course, the rings. Wow, Ooh, I'm so excited. Tags. And I wanted to try this as well um, to make an inclusion. Um, used to watch a lot of, of YouTube videos by Donna Downey and she always had a in inclusion in her uh, art journaling. Just the other day I saw it with um, my deacon as well and also Stephen Bland who uh, was trying uh, this. So yeah gonna try that as well. These are the covers. No, these are not the covers. This is the cover. And there are two of them, of course, so I can alter these. And these are some beautiful, heavy uh, papers and these are craft papers so oh yes there is lots to play uh, with for me uh, hopefully I will get around the, it very soon uh, and uh, maybe I can do something today or tomorrow but and the rings of course so yeah very happy with this, I just wanted to show you. So, uh, for you Dutch people, if you like to uh, know, and I'm not being sponsored by um, Indigo Blue, <coughs> sorry, uh, in any way, but um, yeah, if you like this brand, uh, the shipping cost uh, to Holland are not that expensive at all. So, hope you like this little video and. Um, yeah, you will see me using this very soon. So bye, have a great day.